he's or he's ghosting us. That's that's probably what's happening here. Would not be surprised if he's in the stream right now because there's there's no reason for him to have waited to play the wasteland because he would have gotten it back already. So yeah. It's like probably probably watching the stream. It's possible we just don't want the Crucible of Worlds on the board and we just like want Graveyard Hate to interact with this matchup. I could see a fourth Tormod's Crypt, or maybe even a Leyline of the Void. I think we're about the point where we just concede. <laughs> Mimic snack Greek, the dice to pee fire. Thorns probably not great. I think Chalice on two is just like one of our best ways to win this game, so I think I want them. Okay, so our opponent either just made a bad play or he's sniping. One of the two. Like that's that's that that's the that's the option. I'm assuming my opponent didn't make the bad play, but maybe that's wrong, you know? I don't think we're ever casting Endbringer in this matchup. There's too many wastelands. I got one more cut here. Maybe we don't need all these warping whales. Yeah, let's do Warping Whale's probably better than one of these ratchet bombs. Let's do this. Yeah, I just don't think I can mulligan a hand that has Crypt in the opener. Play Urborg on one here and Crypt. Chip the turn. Turn two matter reshaper. Hopefully we hit Ancient Tomb or Eldrazi Temple. Mm -hmm. Or I. Well, I guess I actually doesn't let us cast reshaper, so we need, we need Temple or something like that. Uh, lands generally does not play Dust Bowl. Sometimes they play a Ghost Quarter to hammer through. Sure, but I think Chalice on 2 is more important just so we don't get Wasteland out of the game. So I'm prioritizing putting Chalice on 2 above putting Chalice on 1. I guess we'll put Chalice on one now. Well, the noose is tightening. Uh, I'm actually just going to let this happen because um, if we hit a land, it can get put into play and not kill City. Wait, I should reveal this. I revealed Thought Knots here. All right. So we're going to tap City, play Ancient Tomb, 
We'll let this die, and then we're gonna play Chalice on two. That turns off our Revoker, but I think I'd rather just get this out here. Yeah, man, wasteland me. This turns off our Mind Stones and our Revokers. All right. Welcome to Legacy. Enjoy your stay. Magic is fun. So much fun! 24 lands in our deck. Now there's a port on the table. He can't actually activate the port though, right? Alright, we're a soul land away from getting Crucible online. Just never playing this Urborg. Because that'll give him that'll give him mana. We think basic. No, I do not. I don't think we want more than 24 lands. I, Mind Stone's good because it cycles. Gamble, gamble, crop rotation, punishing fire, loam. All right. Well, I'm going to get rid of a P fire, I guess, because if he ever draws a way to deal with this, he can have two of. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of that. Pikachu running on screen. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate that. Follows and subs are two best ways to support the stream. I appreciate all that, everyone. A little over 600 people still hanging out. That's great. All right, we drew a wasteland. So I can make two off of this now. This is our activate abilities. Oh, these are these are going to be triggered abilities. So I think I'm going to let this one die, so that way we can have a better chance of finding a land to play the crucible out. That's pretty good. All right, so this is we're definitely letting this die now. So we don't get 20 20 I wouldn't have played the stage until I had more lands if I was him, because like maybe I maybe I don't pay maybe I pay for the matter reshaper. No. Battlefield. Aldrazi. No! Crap! That was a huge mistake. I should have named Horror. Because then I um Yeah, this should have named Horror. That's just that's just a huge mistake. He's tapping it anyways, that's fine. I'm just gonna wasteland his stage. They play four of both, so I'm just gonna get rid of this one because it makes mana. Always skill check him on the maze. Yeah, but it would have put it. It would have put a two. It puts a two one on the table, which is which is relevant. Yeah. 
Phyrexian Revoker can name Mox Diamond. That's the reason it's in my deck right now. We just, we don't have a lot of, we have a lot of bad cards in this matchup. I'm going to play this even though it gives him mana because it gives us mana too. Chalice is on two, so I need, I need a Cavern to be able to play, play for a book out. Well, that's unfortunate. So we are dead, unless he makes a mistake. I could have been more aggressive about playing out, um, playing out the Crucible of Worlds. He says he's thinking in chat. He's an idiot. He should just target this, like not not particularly close. This should just like already be a 2020. He made he made the appropriate play. If he didn't do that, we were going to play Play the Crucible out, but we're just dead now, right? We're just like zero outer. You saw the line, bud. Congrats. He's not an idiot for thinking. He's an idiot for just like, at, at worst, he's, at best, he's slow rolling us. At worst, he's making the wrong play. Like, that's... Revoker's a clock. Revoker is also better than Pithing Needle against... Um, it's better than Pithing Needle against uh, Storm, and it uh, is doesn't get countered by our Chalice in one. It's not that complicated. He's just like he's being at at, at, at best he's slow rolling us like. That's fine. That match was probably abysmal. So we probably want more cards for more cards for lands in the sideboard. I'm not sure Crucible is like where we want to be in life. Winter Orb. That's like only untap one land a turn. That could be okay. Yeah, I saw someone was playing playing Winter Orbs on the board. I could see just a fourth Tormod script too, because it's good against it's reasonable against like Storm and Reanimator too. Leyland of the Void is just not a card. I could I've seen other people play that as well. I mean, Modern has decks that are a uh, playable. Answer. Yeah, I guess the decks that are good are reasonable against Eldrazi and Modern just aren't very good in general against anything else. So we got a little over 700 people watching out. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. We're uh, hanging out, playing some Legacy, practicing for the Open this weekend. We've not played against Sneak and Show, and that's another reason we have uh, Revokers in the 75. It solves all the problems the deck has. Splashing colors into this mana base does not sound like something you want to be in, the thing you want to be doing in life. Keep. Fairy Macabre seems worse than just like playing playing more more Tormod script. 